Okay, you guys, so on today's video, we are going to be doing a few things. One of those things are we are going to go ahead and use a tape measure and we are going to measure different lengths or different parts of the two piece sets just to give you guys a little more general detail on the actual set, the size and um, different variants such as. Another thing we'll be doing in today's video is printing out the names of each style lash, which today I think it's three or four. So we'll be printing out three or four names of different style lashes, and we're going to be using the Nimbot um, label maker. The Nimbot label maker, that's the second thing. And the third thing we'll be do doing is a, um, a pack and ship. So we'll be doing a couple things today. Since we got a lot going on, we're going to go ahead and get started. So grab your tea, grab your coffee, or a snack, and let's get on into Tori's world. Hello. Hey, you guys. Happy Wednesday. So, you guys, on today's video, we are going to do a few things, as I said in the beginning of the clip. And one of the first out of three things that we're going to do in this video is go ahead and pack and ship orders. And we're going to start with the first customer. Um, we will go ahead and start with our first customer. We are going to print our first shipping label i got me some coffee today y'all as i'm sure y'all can see in a donut well i had a donut you get a kid's one and then they still find a way to eat yours too okay i forgot to do one thing i'm human so i have to add the weight of this new arrival to the system. I had um put the weight of the product into the system because I was so in a hurry to get it into the system and um go live with it and make it active. So I forgot a step. But it's nothing you guys would, that would impact you. So it's 15.2. Yeah, so from here on out, I won't have to add the weight in to ship it off. And I wish it would just add the um, same weight for all sizes met, um, on its own, but looks like I'm gonna have to do it manually. I guess the bigger the size. You know what, I'm just gonna do the same 15.2 for all of them. <clears throat> The size ain't going to be that much of a difference, whether it's small, medium, large, or extra large. It's not going to move the scale um, that much. So I'll just put in the same weight. I'm so technical.
I hope everybody is having a good day out there today on this Wednesday morning. And now we actually have the wait in for the new arrival. So I won't have to go in and manually put it in any longer. Go back to orders. Print the pack and slip. <clears throat> Print the packing slip as well, you guys. And the packing slip is just to inform the customer on what they ordered as well as what was sent. So we have the packing slip, you guys. <clears throat> and this is a very good customer of mine. So I am going to be sure to add a gift. So, so what I'm doing right now, you guys, is I'm going to um, size the length and the width of this package to see if my customers can get any um, kind of discount incentives. So, and you don't even know this for shipping today, so she won't be getting anything for this today. But this is just for the system for future reference. It's 15. That's good. So at this moment, I am allowing my customer the fulfill information, letting her know that her item has been fulfilled. Okay. All right. Are you guys all? I'm going to like on the table. 
for him. Hey. Here's her packing slip. Here is the two piece in the original packaging. I'll take that out. Looking for any tags so that I can retag with my brand. Instead of theirs. And I'll just take this right along the seam of the shirt. And now we have our hang tie. Let's see if I can do this cuter. Okay. Again, looking for a tag. And we have our tag again. All right, you guys. So we have that like that. We're going to go ahead and start the fold. <coughs> okay. I'm going to take another for extra protection. Right, and then I'll grab a thank you sticker. We have that wrapped nice and neat, you guys. Kind of like a little clutch, little envelope. Ain't that so pretty? All right, so we have that, you guys. I'm going to set her packing slip on top.
All right, you guys. So this customer is also going to get a, um going to get a like a mini mash, lash. Excuse me. A mini lash kit. So in this little kit comes lashes the lash tool to adhere or to um put the lash on a lash brush not only a lash brush but an eyebrow brush as well and then i am going to include my magnetic glue pen and i love this pen because you literally go across the eyelid like it's the eyeliner pencil a few times you go across a few times and you stick the lash on it and it sticks um i like it so now that i like it i'm going to get them customized get them bottled up and get them on the website so this is what it's going to look like she's going to get a magnetic lash pin a um lash tool the lashes the lash brush okay she is also going to get a thank you card and I start pre-writing these you guys because baby when you trying to um uh, get your orders done you don't feel like stopping and writing this out but I have to put something extra on here because this is a good customer And so now we're gonna go ahead and pack this baby on up. I am waiting on a pending order and then I have a my first local order. My first, first local order. You guys, I don't know what's going on with my tongue today, y'all. I can't I can't talk. You put another business card in her lash kit just to give it a little more professionalism. And let's get this packaged. And then the inside of the my poly mail is you guys there's bubbles like that that stuff your kids like to pop i know mine do. i used to like to do it when i was a kid but it keeps um gives extra protection so i'm gonna slide this baby on in there you guys along with her packing slip her thank you card and the lash kit i'm going to take the sticker off close this baby on up fragile sticker thank you okay and off to the post office we go once I get back you guys we are going to go ahead with the second part of the video which is taking the sizes of the new arrival so that um, I can do a size chart 
and you guys will have a little bit more product awareness um, information on the new arrivals. So give me some time and we'll be back. Okay, you guys, so I am back and I have changed clothes a million times today, y'all. Uh-oh. Trying to change the settings. I have changed clothes a million times. The first time when I did the intro to the video, I had just got through with Prada picks. The second time in the Knight Rider two-piece black two-piece set, I was actually just getting home from the post office and called myself chilling. Then I ended up having to go back out to go back to the post office to put another um, order into the post mailbox. And so now I'm going to actually finish, uh, finish the video. Okay, you guys. So as you've seen today, we did a new arrival on the Georgia Peach Active Wear Two Piece Set, and here she is. And you guys can see that it's a peach color, and I love the dark orange going down the seam of the zipper. It is a high collar, and it is a thumb out set. So what we're going to do, you guys, is we are going to measure the length of this set. Excuse me, mama. Go have a seat. Go finish your popcorn. So we are going to measure the arm of this um, extra large two-piece set that I had on. Okay. So the arm length... So this set is about 25 inches, okay? So I might need to write that down. Okay. Now we're going to do the torso from the shoulder to the bottom. Actually, yeah, from the shoulder to the bottom of the crop top. That's about 16 and a half inches. Okay, you guys. The waist, the waistline of the top is about, I want to say 13, 13 and a half inches. And then the neck. Let's do the neck. And that's about 20 all the way around. Okay. So the arms is about 25 inches in length. The torso is about 16 and a half inches. The waist is about 13 and a half. And then the complete neck is about 20 inches. And then I'll do the back. It's about 15 and a half. So we got those measurements, you guys. And my kids, you guys, got something on the back of my personal jacket. And I hate when it happens. Like, I paid for this. Got respect. 
is my personal one though. So it's not as bad. I'll, I'll get it out with some stain remover. I can't wait to wear it outside. Can't wait to really wear it because what I did today was just model it. So you guys, we're gonna do the pants next. And around the waist of the pant, just um, it's 14. If you take that around, it's about a 27 inches. Okay, and then the length. Mm -mm, mm -mm. The length is about 37 inches. So even a tall girl can fit into these. They stretch both ways. You see that? And this is an extra large. So somebody that's a 2X could fit in here easy. Okay, so we got the inches or the length of the two-piece set. So just for those of you who are curious, the arms, the length of the arms is 25 inches. The torso is about 16 to 16 and a half inches. The waist is about 13 to 13 and a half inches. The circumference. The neck circumference is about 20 inches all the way around. 15 and a half inches is the length of the back of the shirt. And 27 inches is the length of the complete pant. So these details will be included um, into the description um, upon possibly ordering. So you'll have that information. And yes, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Finally, it's the end of the night. <laughs> you guys see this can go on and on your day. You will look around and it will be completely gone, but that's okay because this is what I love. This is my passion. This is my dream. And um, I look forward to doing more of it. So on that note, you guys, I'm going to let you get up out of there. Get out of here. Go spend some time with your family. And guess what? You got to come back tomorrow, right? Love you all. See you later.